So, like, the galaxy's mostly been, mostly been explored. I want to see what happens. I'm going to mostly put things on, on auto, and mostly, mostly, we're going to just kind of see where things go. I, if I conquer some folks, like some fish or so, then, you know, so be it. Um, but I'm, I'm kind of interested in seeing where this goes later on in the game. I've not, I've never gotten to this part of the game, so I'm, I'm curious what all happens. Uh, I am very, very broke. Ahoy there, matey. Ahoy there, matey. Mod, thank you for, uh, two months in a row for the subs. Thank you very much. And Mod, thanks for always being around, uh, for the, for the premieres and over on YouTube. Thanks for, thanks for always being around. All right, so, uh, let's do a little recap. So, uh, um, space is, well, I guess I say mostly explored, somewhat explored. We're here in, I don't know what year we begin in, but we're a ways into the game. A little ways into the game. Still, we're only just now getting, what, carriers now? Um, so, there's a lot. There you go. There's a lot of game left to go. Uh, I, we're probably still in the early game, actually, if you want to think of it that way. Um, but, we have all of this area over here. Let's go top down view here. And... We are at war with the pink folks. I think we're still at war with them. Yep, still at war with them. We're a little weary about that war. However, we are winning that war. We may uh, just sort of like peace out next time they ask. Just to... Um, yeah, I don't really want to, though. I want to destroy them. You know, if we took out this, this Brunadin, we'd cut them off and we'd cut them in half. We'd cut those fish in half. And that's that sounds like something we want to do. Um, anyway, uh, no one likes us. Don't look at that over there. Um, our only friends are some pirates, which are only sort of friends. And uh, we've got a few places around here. Yo Game is our is our capital. We've got Nantare over here to the east, Space East. We got Saipan and Algara. We just took. I think we just took Algara. Right. We finished it last time with by by conquering this planet. I do believe. Uh, there's a little fight going on here as we speak. Actually, um, is this is this it? That's not it. Where's that? Is that that's the planet right there? Right. Yeah. So I think we ended with, we ended as as a um, as a, a a tired guild, as a conquering of that, and so we could come in, you know, cut them off a little bit more. Hey, so, uh, Silas, how's it going? So that you know, maybe we'll end up with that. But we've got like there's a di decent sized fleet over there in Neil Gaiman. Uh, there's a big fleet over here in Argara. We have a sizable fleet of ships, and um, I I should really put some more effort into like f fixing this fleet a bit more. Um, We'll top these guys off. We'll get a couple of really strong fleets. Like the sixth fleet is a is a beast of a fleet, and I think I'm going to use it as like my attack fleet. And then we've got the seventh invasion fleet, which I want to make sure that we get topped up with troops, and we we'll use it as as invasion fleet thing. So we can see if we can just like just a couple of fleets will be our our main attack force. The other folks I'm going to leave them sort of on on automate, and so they can go do defensive things and just kind of keep things alive. So I want you to be like a, a defense guy. And, and uh, another defense guy. Um, one thing very intriguing about this game uh, is, is this sort of the, the the name of the series here is is intriguing, and um, like I've just moved everything over to to doing a lot of automating. I just switched some things some things over there. Colonization is now on automate, and so I've I've you could sit back. I didn't I wasn't thinking about this at the time, but like if you just want to play like the peaceful game. Like, you just want to be the colonizing, you know, the colonizing and out, uh, you know, doing the peaceful the peaceful stuff. You can just automate the military and then do the peaceful stuff, um, which is which is a really, really cool thing. Um, there's a lot of times where, you know what, you're, you're done to fighting the wars. You just want to deal with, you know, building bases and uh, and maybe diplomacy or, or, you know, that kind of stuff. But we could auto completely automate military attacks. All this stuff. We can set a condition for ships. For capture condition. Uh, for bases. When it's in our own territory, we capture that base. And it's a military ship. Always. You know, that kind of stuff could all be set up. You know what? Let's let's make today that day. Let's exp let's, This is the point of this whole th thing. I, we're exploring distant worlds. Two. Let's see what happens. I'm going to fully automate and see what happens. So, attack overmatch factor. So, I guess we have to, we have to beat them by 1.5 before we attack... Um, no, I'm good with I'm good with one. And when do we capture them? When do we capture with bases? Whenever they are in, whenever anytime we're stronger than the target, we take the base. 
military ship as always. Uh, disassemble high tech or larger. Can then we build a new one? Okay, we can keep our scraps around. But no, we'll, we'll keep doing that. Um, enlist upgrade enlisted military ships. I guess if they're, no, not not they are enlisted. Automatically fuel manual ships. Uh, oh, you know that's something I could have on as well because of the ones that I have selected. Uh, retrofit automated fleets. Yes, please. And we can set the percentage of of things. I'm assuming these tooltips will be fixed in a minute. Uh, in, a, in a month. Um, and then we also have troops we can deal with here as well. Colony garrison levels. Attack troop level. Crank it up. Because we're going to get them. We're going to get them. Um, fleet formations will leave it all as automated. A military ship's not assigned to a fleet. Um, okay, those are the ones just sort of out bopping around. Um, and then and then we'll just sort of we'll just sort of sit back and we'll let the game do its thing. And then we'll sort of take take um, take part in whatever we feel we want to be involved in. If I can like sort of inch them a certain way, then we will do that. So let's just let's just see how this goes. We're gonna kind of let it play out. Um, I do have uh, diplomacy set on my manual, so they won't be going and making peace or anything. But we'll um, we'll sort of see how this goes. I set these guys on on you know what? Yeah, you can go be automated. Back to you are a seventh invasion. You are an invasion fleet. Probably should rename these guys. It'd be a lot easier to figure out who's who. So we are. Can I rename you right now? So this is the. Um, we're gonna call this big invasion. My big invasion fleet, and then uh, then sixth fleet. They've got a name as well. Uh, they are just going to be the. Um, they're the horde. Yes. So we know that that's who goes and does the damage. So if we need to do some some uh, dealing with something, we can go do that. We can also set them on raid, which I think is what we want to do with them. I'm not actually sure. No, no, maybe, maybe not. We'll leave them out of attack. Raiding, I think, is sort of like, uh, well, is like you know, hit hit and run. <laughs> so let's let's see what happens. We'll sort of just kind of sit back and we'll kind of just let the game kind of play itself. We'll crank up the speed a little bit, a lot, and we'll sort of let it take place. So all this pink stuff is all more our enemies. We've got folks coming over here and dealing with that, which is great. Um, I really want to go and hit, take out Boonadin. Can I? Is there a way? I'm sure there is a way. Q attack. Not against a buying station. I want to take an attack on. So I can. Can I come in here? New frigate. New frigate. Things are under attack. They want a treaty. And I probably should. They're giving me everything for this treaty. They're even giving me like military bases and things. We met the fire claw pillagers. What do you give me? Give me a spy contact, a mining station, research projects. Tra oh, lots of trees. Lots of research projects. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> lots of research. Decline. Okay, so let's go over here, and we're, we're going to queue up an attack. Disabled. No fleet available to attack this target. Must have fuel under engagement range. Okay. But you can't hit the spaceport. Hit the spaceport. That's probably... That's because no one has any any people on, on board. And then we've got a uh, another another mining station over here. But we'll, we'll hit those things. We'll hit the spaceport first, and then we'll see what happens. What's what I just... Keep an eye on things. Lots of little things popping in here. Mostly we're just building. We're building cruisers. Um, I'm going to have carriers in 11 years, which is a little ways off. Look at all this. I'm supposed to keep up with all this. Research insight. No, it's, that's not me. Those are the bad guys. Coming fleet detected, but we should have defense happening that way. Dirty warriors offers protection. Get out of here. They keep doing that. I don't know what happens. We don't care about that either. Uh, we got a um, the Valiant Star Rider boarded and captured. So we captured a ship. Where's this at? This is here in Sereda, which is in Nilgaiman? No, in Argara. Okay, Argara. Right. So there's still some fighting going on over here. We saw that earlier. Colony of... Is that... Is that Arrakis? The Great Hunt has occurred on Feralis. Colony of the Actarian Technology. Right. What? That is... It's a sandworm. Seventh Defense Force is always under attack. The colony joins us. The oppressed inhabitants of Nilgaiman 7 have switched allegiance from the Akdarian Ascendancy and joined us. <gasps> Excellent. Show me. Show me. These guys? Yeah. You know why? 
because we're great. So that was a planet. So we, we owned this one. They came in and, and conquered that one. Uh, or took it. And this is one they just sort of conquered. And they're just like, you know what? Uh, we would love... Is that a cat person? We would love to be part of um, Not You. Excellent. I like it. So I can just sort of sit back here and I can, like, you know, build planetary defense centers, which sounds like a good idea. Um, raise the taxes if we want. But right now, we'll, we'll, we'll let them be. You know, they came over here. We can let them live for free for a moment. We'll tax them later. The medical aid fleet. <clears throat> Even manageable to, man to manually manage everything. I mean, you could. You, I mean, if you put it on slow speed or normal speed, is pretty slow. You know, there's a half speed as well. So you could. It just would be... You want seven exploration ships? I don't want that. I do want more ships, though. So we're broke, however. How many ships are being built at the moment? Only one state ship is under construction. So that sounds like something we need to be fixing. Um, I know we have new ships because we have a... How do I select the different kind of S? Is it just the escort too? We have to have better escorts, don't we? Oh no, there they are. We're gonna have improved frigates in a year, so I'm not gonna touch anything yet because we're gonna wait till that comes in. Tsunami in Dubat. Um, they're not now. They're rebelling and they're unhappy, and now they've switched. What? Well, make up your minds. And that's it. I'm taxing you next time. What am I supposed to do in that? How how fast do I need to do something about that? We immediately switched. We found some new uh, bugs. <clears throat> I'm sure there's a cheat menu in here somewhere. They want 12 fuel tankers to be built. Man. Um, I don't want the exploration ships. I'll build some fuel tankers for you. You want some of those? I'll get you some of those. I'll get you like... You get, you get eight of them. That's it. Because those new frigates are going to be here in a minute. And we're going to build some of those. Laxlyer, thank you for the, uh, the follow. And they have they have joined us again. So now, what do I do? They have joined us again. They Make up your minds. What do I do to make these guys like me? How can I... What can I do to, ma uh, to, to force... Um... Do I need to put a military here or something? Facilities, shipper base, manage troops. Build a couple troops, I guess. We go. Maybe, maybe if we get some troops in there, maybe they'll be a little happier. There's some civilians going in the cowering traveler. <laughs> Great. There's peace with Tira and, and the bugs. One of my stations are getting, are getting, uh, or my, my mining ships are getting attacked. And as soon as I clean these guys up over here, I think we'll be in a lot better shape. How did my, they're trying to not fight here anymore. So how did... How's this little invasion going on over here? Mission complete. What'd you get? You get some uh, some more tech? Still territory maps. Good job. Did we blow it up? It's still there. Capture the eternal aggressor. Lots of folks under attack. A lot, a lot of mining ships... And I think it's mostly... Well, you know what the problem was? I built a lot of mining stations, like, just, like, out here, like, in Zero Last and that kind of stuff. And it, and actually, I think there's some... Yeah, there's some down here as well. So these guys are, like, in the way. More pirates out there. Lots of exploring happening right now. What else do you want to build? A destroyer and three frigates. I will build that. That I'm okay with. More ships. You want... I'm not, not doing that one. Hang on. So, the, our colonies rebelled again. Um, New Game in 3 is under attack. We're defending this, right? There's a lot of them. Wait, this is their planet? Oh, we're, we're invading? We're invading them? 
Oh, good. Do better. What we got? We're not gonna win that fight. Well, you know what? Some people more have shown up. Oh, we're gonna yeah, we're gonna take it with ease. Nice. Which which fleet is here? There's nobody here. We took it though. Okay, show me. We got it. Okay, so now we have we have this one now. Taxes are already at zero. Zero percent. These guys are very angry. What do we do to make them like us? We can leave our military there, I guess. I'm going to try to build... I mean, we'll get a spaceport started, I guess. Maybe I shouldn't until we... You know, until we know that they're not going to leave us. <laughs> um, I mean, we'll hire, we'll hire a troop and garrison it? I don't know. Did it, just, did it just do it? No, seven. Seven is seven, the problem. Three is the one we just took. Okay. Fierce Pirates want to give us something. What do you want to give us? Uh, ruins for 14,000. I got a lot of money. Um, sure, someone will go do that. We found the uh, some other weirdos. A stone gate. Okay. They want protection treaty. Go away. Um, salvage some more maps. And we put down a repel... Put down a rebellion at three, which is this one. Saipan one has been invaded. Which is down south. Ooh, there's a lot of them there. That's not good. Oh, I can't have them taking my colony. Where's my defenses? Where's my defenses at? Who's over here? Fifth Defense Force. What are you doing? Fifth. Fifth Defense Force. You guys, I'm moving you. I'm switching your home base. No. Okay, I need you there, but I need you. I need you here. Oh no! Yeah, we're getting destroyed there. Oh man, you know, I I um I switch control off for a minute, and this is what happens. Okay, go fly there, and then and then deal with that. Uh, where's my big fleet? So big fleet, where's the horde at? Oh, you're here at at that. Okay. No mission, but you're going to be on defense mode now. But I'm going to switch you... Yeah, defense, fine. Where are you guys going? You're going to go refuel. No, no, no. I want you to go... No more purple here. Oh, there's purple right there. Look at all this. Saipan lost. These guys are unhappy. we got to get my colony back. What we need is Mr. Invasion Fleet. Oh, you guys have a good size of that. So you're loading troops up. Yeah, yeah, you know what? And then you're going to go down here and take this one, right? You can, let's watch and see if they do it on their own. You have your orders. Or you don't have your orders, but you have... I would like you to take this thing. If I go over here and I say, click on this place, and I say, take it. No invasion Fleet with adequate troop strength to invade this colony. But there is. I just looked at it. These guys. Operator, thanks for the follow. So we're gonna hit that. We gotta hit that. That's a casino. They're building a casino. How dare they? I mean, they are big enough. They can. Oh no, there's two thousand troops there. Man, we're losing some money. So, uh, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take Big Fleet, and we're going to tell them to come over here and blockade. The sparkly Moon. If anyone wants to come in here and, and do uh, treaties or whatever, we, we blow them up. 
not treaties, trade. No trade is allowed in, in my old space. 2100 strength, get more. If we say go back over here to Neil or to uh I'm, I'm more involved than I was wanting to be. Over to here. Saipan the uh, ex Exul. Oh mining ship is flying through there. A tsunami in no game in what? Oh, no game in three. Okay. And these guys are, are rebelling again. The humans declared war on me. Wait a minute. But they were our best friends. So I need uh, the, the main place to make me some more things. Okay. Make some troops. Because we need them. Silly humans. Where are they at? These guys are big. They have grown a lot. Look at them. Look at the look at the humans. They're way bigger than I am. Let's go take that place. We finally have the seventh defense force is just always here. Where are you? Second fleet. Where are you going? You're going to stop. Okay, you're going to Saipan. Big invasion fleet over here. We're just sort of hanging out. There's big invasion right there. Yeah, they're hanging out in Algara, which is good. We have no one hanging out over here in Nantare. Who who wants to hang out in Nantare? Maybe what I should do is I should tell, like... I mean, you're tiny. Look at you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Okay, top up your fleet, and then I'm going to move you. This is who? This is ninth. Well, just go ahead and top off. I don't want to send you somewhere else. I, I can't be peace now because they took my colony. Look at all the stuff they're going to give me. They're giving me so much stuff for peace. There's a sizable fleet coming at me. All right, you know what? Peace for a moment. For a moment. Okay, and he told us about all kinds of things. We got a million different... They got advanced missiles. We've got dedicated carriers. We don't want to talk to humans now. We've got a uh, shield research. Oh man, these guys are kind of smart. But we got all okay. That worked out. That was good. We'll get that colony in a minute. In a minute. But first, we have humans to kill. Peace is always temporary. That's right. Kurt Maximus, thanks for the follow. So Boonadin over here, you are no longer a target. Can I tell you this to stop attacking that? You didn't. But, okay, it's not marked anymore. New frigate, new frigate destroyer. Hey, now we got some ships coming in. Good, we got humans to deal with. Is there a, um, is there like a chart? You know, like graphs to see how, um, how far behind, <laughs> how far behind I am? Well, we got one of these guys. How much do you cost? 90,000 credits. I could send them back to make them happy, or I could just kill the guy. We'll just hang on to him. We'll just lock him in a prison for a little while. Okay, here we go. So the humans are in Nanta Ray. So I need to get... Come on. I need to get my fleet over there. Yeah. The sly arrow. There's the human. Human ships are kind of neat looking. Very, um, well, boxy. Look at little bugs. Uh, what do we got? What, how strong is this fleet here? 2,700. Okay. Um, we have a fleet that can handle that. You. Second fleet. I really need you to get here and defend. Uh, yeah, just attack this fleet. Yeah, I think you're already over... Oh, you're way over there. Get here faster. Dang humans. Dang humans. Posture check. All right, all right.
<clears throat> Your destroyer unlocked. We should be at. Oh, we do have it. We do have it. Oh, battle cruisers are what we're working on next. Okay. I like the sound of that. Um, yeah, I'll leave that as it goes. Free under attack and traveling towards Iron Axe, which is all down here in Nantare. They apparently want Nantare. Well, they ain't going to get it because the eviscerator of Yogim is here. Where is this at? Where are you at? Are you in their home world? What are you doing over there? Doesn't seem like a really safe place to be. Doesn't seem like a safe place to be at all. Why are you there? First fleet. Um, you're pretty strong. I mean, all right, uh, go for it, I guess. You want to break things, you go for it. Is it the case now that you only research one thing at a time now, rather than three of the? No, you can do multiples. Just the more you do, the le the slower you get with it. The slower they read, so it's kind of split amongst uh, things. So three, so we expect four in influence on this rebellion. Yeah, I suspect it. I don't know what to do about it. I don't know what to do about it. Um, corruption, dissidents. We tire of our empire's wars. You know, I'm I'm trying. I, I didn't. I didn't start the other war. They did. It's all their fault. Once they get a little more, what are we at here? How do I see how how um? What's the word? Uh, um, swayed they are. I don't see it. Not much I can really do about that. I think they just want to get out of the war. Everyone's really mad about the whole war thing, which I don't understand. You should be joyous. But you get to fight another day. Okay. Uh, do we have any friends over here? Maybe someone wants to go and would like to assist me in fighting these guys. They're only displeased with me. They like me more than pretty much anyone else. These guys are kind of friendly. Uh, the Hakonish Enclave are pleased with us. Hey, we like your style, he says. Of government. Who's that? That's these... No. Green. Green, green. Is that you over here? Yeah, they're way over there. What are they going to do? See so maybe we can get buddies with them. Let's chat and see if we can get buddies. So, if I want to get a limited, we need... Improved by 9, so 15 is the next mark. So, let's send him a gift. I will give you... Um, oh, you know, I have a lot of tech that you don't have. Maybe maybe you're dumb. Hey, you can learn to talk to us. There we go, up plus 20. I would like a limited trade agreement. Gladly accept, he says. Free trade is too soon. We'll see what happens next. Okay, look, we got buddies. Some guys with some weird frog. Are they frogs? They're kind of lizard-like. Okay, and then... Where is these... Where are these guys at? Everyone's, everyone in this galaxy is, is a shade of blue or purple. Except for me. The, um... The Izukrin... Are the ones that are always fighting the humans. We have relations with our friends, he says. Like, maybe we make friends with them and we get them to join our fight. So, what do you say? What do you say? I say, um... I'll give you contact with some people. You know, that sounds like an idea. Like an idea. Um, oh, you have my spy? <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been spying on you for a while, haven't I? What do you think of this deal? Oh, you know, plus three. He, he says that's not enough. We need plus seven. Uh, 
you can keep the spy. I'll, we'll keep an eye on you. Okay. I forgot. That's the guys we've been spying on forever. Um, we should be spying on someone else. Oh, now they're offering a, offering a trade agreement? Yeah, you know what? Sure. Okay. So, look at me being peaceful. Let's get my spies over here. Uh, the ones who are working on... You're working on the Hakunish Enclave, our buddies. No, let's change that. Cancel that one. I want you to go and target the Ascendancy. Don't steal their maps. Oh, they're, they must be. They have, must have a lot of spies. I want to steal tech. They must have a lot of tech. We also have the smart guys. Mission target. I don't care. Whatever you want. Fast missiles, I guess. Four percent probability. I mean, why are they so good? Okay, up this no. How about the humans? Let's steal some human tech. You know, maybe you're just not very good. Anyone we're good at stealing stuff from? The Vascara Conformity. Apparently they're terrible. Take their stuff. Yeah, that sounds like an idea. Go get that. Who are you stealing from? You're stealing from the Vascara folks also. And you're stealing from the Vascara folks. Alright. You're not very good. You're not good at all. So I'm going to send you to the humans. And I want you to go and sabotage some things. That'll show them. Go blow up. Um, I don't care what you blow up. Just blow up something. Uh, you know. I don't care what you get. What are the consequences of failure? They can get captured. Like that that spy that the the bug people or whoever the frog people I was talking to. Or no, it's the bug people. I've been spying on these guys for a long time. That's where a lot of the tech's been coming from. I've been taking it from them. And uh, they captured one of my spies because he failed This is Nanta Ray. My fleet is finally arriving. Right, this is my fleet. This is, yeah, the 10th, the, well, 10th fleet. I don't see any blues in here now. There's a fleet right there. Third invasion fleet. That's what we want to hit. Tenth invasion fleet and the 5th defense fleet is here. You know what we could do to end this war? We, we take it to the home world. We saw how tough they are. They ain't that tough. There's a bunch of filthy humans. There's only 9 billion of them there. They have 17,000 defense strength there. We're not taking that one. Alright, second fleet is finally arriving here. So we've got some folks piling up. Maybe. Maybe. Rorea could be taken. Is this, this star any good? There's Rocky Desert Moon. There's a billion people there. It is perfect for me, actually. You know what? Let's take it. I want to invade this. We don't precisely know the defending troops at the colony. I want to just attack it. Maybe we just send our evasion fleet over here. It's not very automated if I tell them where to go. Um, second fleet. Go, uh, just go bombard. Or blockade, I mean. And then I'm going to send in my, this guy. Who isn't really all that strong. Why don't you get some more troops before you come over here? So let's fight that peppermint. Manta ray. Is it? No, that's that's not Manta Ray. Because that force out there we should go we should go squash real quick. Where's the What are you going over there for? I didn't tell you to go over there, I told you to attack the other guys. You don't listen. Okay, come over here and attack that fleet. This is the horde, right? The horde's doing that? Okay, yeah. I just told them to go attack, and what are they flying back that way for? I don't get it. That happened a few times where I tell them, it seems like I'm clearly doing something wrong, but if I tell them to go to a point, they go there. If I tell them to attack something, they can do whatever they want.
Okay, here they come. Agent was captured. Oops. Cancel the treat. No, no, I'm canceling the treaty. In a minute, colony has been discovered, and what else? Oh, you go away. Uh, the Kitteroff. We haven't met them before. Bunch of furry doggies. Okay, second fleet. You're going to blockade now? You're going to listen to me now? Did I have the wrong one selected? I think I did. I think I sent the, I sent the second fleet in, and the Horde is the one who I want to be sending in. Okay. I don't see any blue ships in my space. I just see them. We're, like, sending things that were here at them. So let's just, let's just send them here. We'll send, so the second fleet will go uh, deal with that. And then we'll send in our troops. They're going to get loaded up right now. And we'll go take that planet. Cut them off. Oh, was that Sol? Really? Look, it is Sol. Jupiter, Saturn. Oh, look at that. Mars. Wow. Check it out. Look, it's Earth. Well, Attackman. Hey. These are the uh, independent humans living over here. We should go take that. That's when we have a win. We got a foreign agent coming at us. There's a fleet. That's what is doing a lot of fighting over here. Now we're going to Tira. Um, so that, that's a you're going to go blockade. We've got... You're nothing. I'm not at war with you. Um... Invasion fleet. I need you down here to take this planet. Stop it with the blinks. What's going on? Just move here for now, and then we'll then we'll get you in there. You guys are gonna go blockade, and then they'll, then we'll move you move you in and take it out. This will be my planet. I'm not sure why we're going to Tira and trying to hit their home world. I like I like the enthusiasm though. Uh, so we've got sensors on our ships. That's what that's where our uh, our scanners are giving us information. So when we get closer to there, we'll see we will see things. So we are we should be accurate here now. Oh, we're here. We should be pretty accurate. We can go scan their planet also, which we I think we've done. Oh, yeah, we're there. So we can see what's all is here. Defense strength of thirty two now uh, twenty eight. A lot of those pluses are just because of like you know, um, space control for instance, which just popped up. We also have a... Oh no, just a grand hall. Okay. 32 is a sizable amount. More than I've got. Um, as long as we keep this place blockaded, though, I think we'll be better. We'll, we'll hang out here for a little bit, blockade the thing, space control and all that. I think we'll be good there. Oh, we found dinosaurs! New independent colony of Naxilians and Vudrin 8. Naturally hostile towards us. Um, hello, dinosaur. I like the look of you. Goodbye. Just some independent dinosaurs. So we're blockading, so we're just going to destroy all these little ships that are flying around here. But it should give us space control as soon as we blow them all up, I guess. Non-aggression treaty. Sure. Friend. Uh, 41 credits for bombardment weapons. Sure. There's a lot of purple folks on in my land. In Terra, why, why are we going? Why are we going there? We may have a. Oh, I bet you we have a. Um. I bet you we built a, a mine somewhere over here. Yeah, you're built. You're going to build a space dock over here in Andat. Yeah, that's what's going on. Came death. Troop transport in Nanta Ray. By what? There's no one here. Three is mad. Here. 
You guys are here? Yeah, they're here. Okay, so... I don't know if we can hit this yet. What's our strength? 3,200. That's, that's so strong. What can I do to, to get this? This is the second fleet here right now. They're blockading. Horde, you guys are back on in, on auto. Second fleet. What if I tell you just to, like, attack? They're too, they're too strong. Why are they... See, look, they're all leaving. Why are they... Oh, because they're going to fuel... Why, did, why are they leaving? Hmm. Okay, stay here and block it. Maybe bomb it a little bit. And you know what? Bomb it a little bit. I'm gonna let you. Can I tell you to blockade? You blockade. For a moment. Ooh, light bombers are done. Yeah, let's bomb this place. Yeah, there we go. Now we're getting some... Oh, now we're getting somewhere. Okay. Yeah, now that... Well. The whole space control thing bouncing up and down. I don't know how to, how to take care of that. Like, well, clearly we have space control. But there's a couple little miners around here, and that's what's, that's what's causing the problems. I don't know. There we go. Now, so now we gotta hit them. Let's attack it. We have the strength. Assuming we drop our people off. What happened to our, what happened to our 2,700 people? Found some moles. So, like, they're there, but they're just dropping them off whenever they feel like. Ahoy there, a few maybe. more there. Michael Dark, thanks for two months. Thanks for the subs. It just like drops them all off in like little parts. So you have to have an overwhelming number to beat them. It's not like they were slowly coming in from way out. We had them surrounding the colony. Well, we're doing it, I guess, maybe. Just slow. I think it's everyone right now, so we've got pretty much... Yeah, it's not going to work, I don't think. Going the wrong way. If we dropped them all off at the same time, we would have been fine. But it didn't, and it just sort of just squandered my forces there. I really don't know, don't know what to do about that. Go load up. I'm sure I'm missing something. How do you how do you get them to attack when you want them to attack? We had the numbers. Hmm. Okay, well, you guys go back and uh, go back and be an invasion force and go back and, and fuel up. Invasion fails. Yeah. Am I still bombing them? I think I might be. Maybe we should stop bombing them. Go back to just blockading. I know with 1100 strength. There's got to be a coordinated attack somewhere. Yeah. Oh my god, I'd just be missing it. Free trade, sure. Blockading. You are... What are you guys doing? You're chasing these guys down? Okay. They're running away. Where are you? Not to Ray. Got, look at the pluses we got, though. That was a big, big deal for us. 
Now offers a gift. Galaxy map, all exploration, and some scanners. They want, uh, you'll talk to somebody, okay? Uh, I'm gonna send the third, the third fleet in. Should I send them in there also? I don't know, they're probably doing a good job just keeping things defended. We only have a thousand. Where's the other fleet? I'm just gonna hang out there. Uh, can I get you? <clears throat> if I can zoom, zoom to a ship, you can go real far. You can go super far. Uh, there's actually, you know what, there's a button I just found out. There's a button somewhere. Um, I don't know my keys though, to go into like, like, cockpit view. I don't know how to do it though. Bridge camera. Ah, yeah, check it out! You got kind of a boring bridge camera, but let's go to trailing. I don't know what he's shooting at. Let's find someone that's a little more exciting. Or someone that's shooting. Here we go. Let's go to this guy over here. So let's go to bridge. Yeah, you know, <laughs> bridge camera's a little, a little, uh, <laughs> not, not a whole lot going on with bridge, but the trailing camera. A little more thrilling. Ooh. It's a lot more thrilling. That's kind of neat. I'm just gonna keep on building our strength back up before we get over there. Um, let's see how we're doing here. It's only a thousand there. I don't think I'll be having more troops to put on there. Everyone's empty. No colony, but I'm going to the troops required by army, army template. What offer you want? You're going to give me things. Sure. These guys are, I have friends all of a sudden. What happens? Spider people? Let's go back over here. What are you going to sell us? Trade agreement? Sure. These uh, frog people are kind of nice. And you want to give me basic diplomacy of somebody for 12000 I don't really care about diplomacy so much. I think we need to make more troops. Can I automate the troops? Automate the... Um, he's on there, but it's not, not happening. So... Let's get some more troops. Lots of troops. A whole bunch of troops. If it is any good. Remember at one point we had some pretty sizable ships. We had like, what, three? No, we had like 5,000. I think we ended up with 8,000 worth of, 6,000 worth of troops. You know, Gaiman is always angry. They'll get over it once they get a, you know, once they, once they get a scent of, of what our lizard people are like. Then they'll, they'll be alright. Uh, do we, do we take something? Don't you just, you just hang, oh, is there a mining station there? Oh, I see. Might as well, yeah, keep on cleaning this stuff up. So you're blockading. You're over there chasing these these guys around, which I kind of like. Keep them under control. A gift. Sure, I'll take a gift. Wait. Thank you for... No, no, I don't want... No, I want you to give me... <laughs> That's your front way. 
<laughs> uh, get out of here. I want you. <laughs> I thought you were giving me a gift. Um, we're invading the independent colony. Why are we doing that? Monlel Mayfer. This is part of the thing of going to automation. Um, sure, treaty. Uh, where's that one at? This, this one. Oh, we're, we're attacking that? Why are we doing that? I'm, fi I'm fine with that. We got it. See, you know what? We do just fine whenever I have no... When I have no involvement. Everything is great. <laughs> Maybe I should keep my hands off more often. They're rebelling. Rebellion crushed. Good. Where's my fleet at? There's just a bunch of them here now. We should probably get some ships over here. Who's that? Fourth invasion fleet. Uh, where are you at? You're going to repair... I probably could use it. You know, why don't you just hang out down here for a little while? Go, um... Just go guard it. More, more rebellions crushed. Yeah, you know what? I should just let my, uh... My people, uh, play on their own. Rebelling, rebelling. Colony of Usarian are tired of our oppressive rule and proclaim independence. What'd you do that for? Why are you kicking me out? Really? We colonized over there? What we do that for? Again, colonizing I have set up on, on auto. I thought it'd be interesting to see what all we would do with it. I guess we do things like that. It is a nice rocky planet, but it's so far away. I don't know how we could even try to do it. Oh, look at those. Uh, those are some lizards. Okay, now. Where is my big invasion? Go load up. Why don't I dismiss them? Because they're just, they're not, they're non-stop. So I would be, that would, that would be the whole game, which would be dismissing those. I used to keep up with it, but now it's, it's, it's beyond now. Trade agreement, chirp. Who are the lizards? Or are they frogs? I think maybe he's a frog. This is, Serrata have tired of our oppressive rule and switched allegiance to the Ectarian Ascendancy. What? It's because of that. That war weariness is, is tearing us apart. It's over here, but I spent so much time taking that colony. Captured a foreign agent. Oh, you dang cat with shades. Yeah, this war weariness is really tearing us apart here. We got unhappy colonies. Let's see if we can get um, a sizable invasion force. Take a planet and then be done. Be done with with war for a little bit. Yeah, they go away after a while. That's, that's what they're going up here. Okay, that's, that's where one fleet is. I'm still disappointed by it. Uh, both of these have, have fallen now. I'm trying to grab some stuff over there. Lots of fighting going on over here. Pirates looks like. Where are those troops already? Where are you? There they go. They're getting them now. Let's see how many they grab. They got 161 so far. Well, it should hopefully go up to like 2,000. That would be nice to have. <laughs> Master, thank you very much. Trade agreement with England. Yeah, trade agreements are great. All these uh, these independent folks, look at, we've got best friends all of a sudden. Now that we are hated and despised, everyone's like, hey, you know what? You're all right. We have a, we have a diplomacy going on here with, with these folks. These are the guys we gave a gift, which I did not need to do. Uh, they are neutral with us, though. Where, where are, You're just a independent. I don't care about independence. You're nothing to me. 
These are guys that were friends with us. They are mad now because... Um, I'm at, oh, because I'm... My friendship with your enemies. Oh, I see. Minus 50. Oh, here's our buddies. Yeah, both these guys. Uh, we can probably get something with you, too. We, we have a map. We have an integration pact. Can we get, like, an alliance with you? We're at plus 50? Man. My wife doesn't like me that much. What do we have here? I might, um, oh, oh, we have a migration treaty with you? Doesn't align with our goals. Does not align with our goals. Are you sure? Offer limited trade. We're already up there. So we're up to, we're already at a migration treaty. All right. Well, that's kind of nice. Well, what can I get from you? Contact. I want contact. What about, uh, what about someone else over here? These guys are alright. We have a limited trade agreement with them, so I think we need 15 to get anything better with these guys. <laughs> Share maps and trade with your wife. <laughs> Alright, well. A lot of them are independent folks that we seem to like. Uh, whatever. I kind of want soul here, though. There's one I want to conquer. It's that one. I should be able to set up. Let's see if I can. Desert colonization complete. That's good. Mission complete. Evaded detection. We got a volcano. What's this one? The hostile library has been taken over. Our frigate has been taken over by the Terra Nation. Where? Are we still fighting in Terra? Yeah. I don't know why. It seems like a bad place to be. It seems like a real bad place to be. So, who was that? How's my how's my my fleet looking? That's it. Get more people. Maybe there's not enough troops there. You're loading troops as well. Moving over. If I can tell him to stay away from that one. I'm sure there is a way. Things are super chaotic mid-game. Yeah, yeah, it gets pretty 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 crazy. I'm also on like 4x speed. But our goal today is just sort of see what the what the end what the well, we're not even in what the late early game looks like. Humans are massive. I feel kind of tiny next to them. I um, I don't think there's any sort of... Is there... Oh, oh, hey, here's what we're looking for. Okay. Is it not paused? Yeah, pause the game. Let's go over here. Victory conditions. So the Bascara is these purple folks. The, the bugs? Where am I at? I don't know. I guess, is that me? I'm the yellow guys. There's me. So, um, oh, I think I okay. I think I see how this, this is this is reading. So there's me. I'm way down here. Where's that? Is that the humans we're fighting right now? That's the humans we're fighting at the moment. So the different conditions. So we've got like economy conditions, population, territory, and and um, uh, whatever. You can see how we're doing. We control 8% of the colonies of the 75 we need. Or 3%. Conquer the most enemy colonies. We've conquered 5. Hey, look at that. That's something. Uh, Nor and Bob, thanks for the follow. These guys have done some things too. They have destroyed a bunch of ships as well. Bascara. So, there's four different ways to win. I guess, yeah, I guess each race, there's a Boscara race victory conditions. I'm not sure how that works. Exterminate or enslave the most people in the galaxy. Human race conditions are control 100% of the con uh, continental con colonies. Have the most defense treaties. Earn the most trade income. What was ours? 
Win at least 70% of our wars, subjugate the most empires, have the most experienced admiral and general. Interesting. Very interesting. So then the humans, they want, these guys want uh, tourism income also. Interesting. Keep loading. Water colonization research is done, which is good, good, good for us. We've got some watery planets. That's just, um, that's just a threshold, though. I'm not sure if that does us any good for the plants we already have. I was looking over here. Out of out of people to put on our our, our ships. Um, Eleven sixty two is we need more than that. You're guarding. Um, you are you're fitting there. Why don't you? Okay, let's go take a let's go take a planet. I'm with this one. This one this one is is doable and it's nice and nice and deserty. We like deserts. Thing going on over there, and yeah, we got We got We're gonna do this, and we're gonna we're gonna end it soon. So come over here and just bomb, and you as well. Come over here and bomb. Uh, load up, load up a couple more troops. There's a couple more there. Yeah, military di dictatorship. I could see that could be. We have a pretty good... Our war weariness doesn't go down as, as fast either, but we have been at war for, well, like 500 years or something. A long time. Okay, 1,500. That's better. Let's get them over here. Let's get them both over here. Take this place. We can, we can do it this time. We can do it. Come over here and just bombard. We're going to bomb them. Uh, pirates. Capital ship research is complete. We can now make what? A battle cruiser? Okay, we'll get them to come over here and we'll take this place. We'll see if we can get peace. Going a little bit the wrong way there. I think... Where's that? Oh, that, that's good. On my way, right? Yeah. Okay, so they made their way there over here. We're almost on our way there. Let's capture something. Cage. Thank you for the follow. There's 10 billion humans over there. That's a lot of humans. Bombarding the colony. Yep, get over there and bomb them. Second fleet, here comes uh, the big invasion. What, so you, okay, I'm reading this this time. Propose a gift. You want me to give them a gift? I'm not giving them a gift. That's ridiculous. We don't do gifts. Murderous Fang, go away. Um, modifies trade relations. Downgraded our trade relations to limited trade agreement to restricted... What? How dare they. Okay, so here comes the big invasion. Once they show up, once they start bombing, we'll, we'll send them in. We'll try to send them in all... We're going to get make sure they're all here, and then send them in. They're rebelling again. Gonna keep on happening. We're being crushed. Good. We've got lots of troops there, so I'm hoping that's what's stopping them. Is that big invasion? Big invasion is here. Okay, so how are we doing? 
We, we, it's gonna be, it's, I don't think it's gonna happen. We can keep on bombing them and see if we can get a little bit weaker. 2,500, we're not gonna be able to do that. I haven't found a pl planet destroyer yet, so no. I'm aware of them, but I haven't found one yet. We'll drop a bunch of bombs. We've been doing a lot of bombs already. Um, who's that that's here? First fleet. Bomb them. Let's just keep on bombing them. If we get, we get a below 2,000, then we hit it. Are these guys here too? No, they're somewhere else. Get it. Let's get a little further. What? But I want to get out of war, though. Eighteen hundred. Should we do it now? Could go a lot lower. I mean, we're bombing the snot out of them. What do you think? Get it now. Attack. Who else is there? You. Okay. Now we got it. There we go. There we go. My planet. Let's watch that number go up. 33k. Yeah, our reputation's bad, and so people are, because we're bombing them, people are getting mad at us, and so we're getting more are going to be declaring war on us because of that. Okay, done. My planet. All right, uh, let me pause real quick. So let's go talk with the humans. It's at one thirty-eight. That seems like something. A treaty. Uh, I, I would like a negotiated deal. How about this? So, peace. Um, oh, you're not going to do peace. Come on, but I'm winning the war. What if I just say... Peace. No, we fight on, he says. Ah, come on now. I just took a colony. You should, you, should not, you should not do that. I'm going to leave... You're going you're to go take Tira Ray, which is which one? Tira... Th way. Tira Way. That's their home world. They really want to keep on fighting. You know what? You, you go for it. Big invasion force. Go back to invade. Do whatever you want to do. Invasion fleets. You go invade. First fleet. Yep. Put you on attack. Second fleet. You're a good attacker, so go attack. Okay, we'll go back to automated here and let them do the thing. It's not going to go well. People are going to keep on rebelling from us. Like right there. Borden captured the, the muffled adventure. No game in three is really unhappy. We could offer a gift to make him like us a little more, but surely we can take these guys down. We've cut them in half. My fleets apparently are heading over to here. There's no one here anymore, though. Why don't you just go break Nintan? There you go. Go break that. We got some tech coming in. We got recreation systems. Uh, the Horgelium tells us tells about an attack against our colony Ur Usarian One. There are strange rates of hybrid insectoids. Savage group attacked with a crazed, merciless rage, consuming everything in their path. Wraith live in terror that these vicious monsters may return. Excuse me? This is on I think normal difficulty. I don't know, whatever the default one is. Oh, hey. Look what we found. And there's, there's three of them? Oh, my. 
There's <laughs> okay, so um Okay. So these are like bad bad news. Look at the look at the strength. Thirty nine thousand on this thing. Yeah, they're bad. And um Where's this at? This is an Usarian, which is oh, it's way over there in the middle of okay, not near us anywhere. So they're gonna go around and start, you know, basically just eating everything. They're bad, bad news. Um Remember I mentioned at the beginning of this that um, this game is is not balanced. I think it's a, it's a, it's it's well done, not balanced, um, because you know like it's not a multiplayer game, and it, it um, you may have some things like that that just sort of just come sliding on into the galaxy, and you can have them like early on and kind of ruin your day. Uh, but it, I think you know it adds to the challenge. It's not a game. In my opinion, not not a game to like. It's a game to win, you know what I mean? It's a game to play. If that makes any sense? Um, everyone's getting mad at us and switch. Oh, seriously? I just took this place and you've switched. I don't understand what I can do to keep you here. How many troops do I have to have? Defense force of twenty-four. Who's here still? Tenth Invasion Fleet is here. Take that. I didn't go to all this trouble just for you to leave. You were my colony, whether you like it or not. Oh, they're dropping troops off as well. Stop that. It was my colony. And taking my my no. How do you get the troops through? <laughs> Oi. Invasion fails. You tell me about it. <laughs> why can't you guys like you? Why don't you leave and come back over to me? They were prepared. They like they rebelled and they had an invasion fleet there at the same time. Convenient. Uh, they offered to end the war. Yes, I accept. That was the bugs that were fighting us. We got out. Of, we got out of one of them. We got to get out of the second one. I don't think we're gonna be able to, because these humans. It's just a problem. It's go. It's trending up though. Their war readiness is my twenty minus twenty six. Like that. Like that. Uh, peace. Fight on. He says. We didn't grab that one, just sort of um, out of the blue there. I like it. I'm curious about what these things are going to be doing over here. Build a frigate? Sure. Lots of attacking, and, and mostly it has to do with my my miners that I've got sent out there. Too far. Where is... No mission. What are you? It's not much of a fleet, is it? Get out of here. Yeah. I'm going to take this fourth fleet. Where's my big invasion fleet? We'll take the horde and we... Actually, the horde I'm happy with. Big invasion fleet. Let's go. You need topped up? No missing ship rolls. Um, yeah. Okay. Where's that fourth fleet? Fourth invasion fleet. Are you uh, topped up too? Yeah. I build a destroyer. We're broke again. Remember we had like two hundred grand. I never had a problem. I played this game a bit off 
um, stream as well. I never had a problem with, with money. It's always like, ah, oh, cash flow is actually up now. Um, it's never uh, um, been really an issue. Whenever it's like way down, then we usually get surges of money from our, our, our civilian economy. So things are usually okay. But anyways. Target rich environment. That's right. That's right. And no matter how many times we take them, they come back like fleas. The frigate. Um, what do you want? Ancient ruins? I don't care. I would really like to just bomb this place over and over again. That'd be great. Their strength is back up to where it was before. Big invasion can come take it again, but do we really want to? We will. Who is this? This is the horde. Yeah, you guys are just attacking that. Just, just uh, blockade it. Get these little blue ships out of here. I would turn my attention to something a little more, uh, a little more exciting. Oh man, I don't need more, <laughs> more war. Uh, Tenocracy is... Who is that? Everyone's the same color. Uh, kind of... They're, they're, they're these guys. Oh, man. Do you just have... No, you got a bunch of planets. Well, I can't fight more than one war! I can't even fight one war. I would love to come in here and, and hit their homeworld. Just make my day. But wow, there's too many of them. We never leave. I mean, we're here picking on them, sort of auto automatically. Um, which is where most of my fleet. I think we're losing a lot of ships probably over here. Choppy, choppy. I just want the one. Big invasion's on their way there. I'm going to go take it back. It's going to be mine. Plus 202. Excellent. I wonder how high that needs to be for us to, like, get a, uh... Like a, a, a peace... Um, give them to start begging us for, for peace. Okay, here they come. Big invasion. Let's see if I can watch the, the transports get sent out. Let's go with uh, with trailing view. There he goes, going in. Look at that beautiful planet. It looks like a nice place to live, doesn't it? So we should see um, something get shot out of this guy. Oh, go away. There it goes. You see it? Little thing gets shot out. 4,000 of us this time. Caden, thank you for the follow. 5,000 of us. This is my colony. And how dare you even think about not leaving it to me? Now, what do we do? Uh, there's going to be some way of of of, uh, of securing this. How do I do it? Full of tails there. Our troops are there. We can't make any new troops yet. They're very angry. Understandably. There's no taxes. Everything's automated. Population policy. What, what do we what do we do with this? I'm not really sure where we set that up. Colony defense. I want just standard colony. I can't, the problem is I can't get a I can't get a space station built by the time they they come in. I don't have money either. Can't rebel. <laughs> Nobody lives there. <laughs> Tax rates automated. Recruitment garrisons. Stock levels. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave my ships there. 
That way it leaves the military there. What can I do with you guys? Um... Yeah, it's probably taxing people to death. Probably so. Yeah, it's probably a lot of that going on. Alright, so I took the colony again. What do you say? You should be ashamed. What do you want for peace? How do I see what you want? Fight on, he says. I'm not giving you a station. I'm the one, I'm the one winning this fight here. Right, we're, gonna, we're gonna keep him there. If we get some money, we'll go buy the station. Ooh, we got that one too. Um, that one's still hanging in there, and Neil Gaiman is still hanging in there. They're very cranky, but they're hanging in there. We took out the belligerent rebellion in Nintan. Yeah, we're fighting him in Nintan. Open rebellion in, in, in Neil Gaiman three. Raw, bad place to live. Uh, more lizard people. Uh, attack, attack. You know what we should be doing with... Well, my spies aren't really good. So I'd say we can spend spies in to go and like... Um, try to get some plants to turn to turn to me. Now who's rebelling? No game in three. I have to do that. Uh, let's talk with... Who's this one? This is the... These guys. Hey, what about Peace. Final he says. My rotation is minus 23. It's rising quickly, though. Uh, I'm attacking civilian ships, which is... Oh, that's bad. <laughs> I guess all these, all this blockading uh, kind of has a damper on the reputation. <laughs> you know what? That's what they get for being humans and not w w welcoming us with open arms. We put him down. <laughs> Humans are probably back there talking about how, like, we're the bad guys or something. Uh, you know what? Yeah, the computer says I should offer a peace treaty. I don't think it's going to happen. But I'll send it. We reject your treaty. How? What? What? Our war will continue. See, look, we're the good guys. We're trying to make peace. And they're just over here attacking us non-stop. Nothing we can do. We're just trying to be as friendly as ever. I'm going to keep my, my, my ships there because I don't want them to come in and sneak in a bunch of troops again. Or a bunch of uh, ships. You guys are over there fighting evil exile. Troop transport research complete. Hey, that's something we could use. Medium troop transports. That would be very good if I had more troops. Be real good. Dinosaur, dinosaur diplomacy. Hey, a new admiral showed up. All right. Stole some tech. Well done, buddy. Well done. Uh, I have a... You're in... You're going to load up troops. Okay, yeah. Go do that. And you know what? Refit while you're... Top up your ships... Okay, we're not or, or refit. Go go retrofit. Get your sh bigger ships in there, and we'll see what we can. What we kind of invasion force we can get here. Like you know what the game they wants me to be at war, so be it. There's an evasion force going to Nanta Ray. I don't see him though. Attack. They're over here in... Over here, too? Yeah, they're over here. That's where the most of them, I think, are hanging out. Who is in... Who's here? This is the Ninth Strike Force. Okay. You guys are defending this, alright, hopefully.
keep keep your defending. Second fleet's over there taking out that the other one's over there at Nintan. Yeah, good good defense there. Yeah, lots of big big fleet over there. Oh, we lost it. No game three's been con been captured. Oh, the the Darians again. These guys. Um. All right, Nintan, you're dealing with with the humans over there. You're keeping them busy, which is probably a good thing. But we've got these fish people over here. I just being annoying. Can you come over here and deal with this? I forget. There's too many the same color. Come over here and come on, come on. Uh, who was it? You. Nintendo 3, Nintendo 1. We've got two people over there. Send the big guys over. Go attack. Don't, no, no, no blockading, I guess. Stole some tech. And then whenever this, these guys are ready, we'll send them over to take it. How bad, how good can fish be at defending? Retrofitting up to just a regular old troop transport. Yeah, yeah not, nothing upgraded yet. Those look bigger though, aren't they? Look at all that red over there. Um, top up. We got a planet to take back. Big sandstorm. If my ships start showing up, then we'll send in the invasions. So we got a sizable group of people there in um, at home. The Pakri system over here. What are you doing? Over, uh, what is over here? Oh, miners. <laughs> There's so much going on. Okay. All right, are you here? Okay, so the, the attackers are here. Let's send in the invasion. They're loading up still, but you've got enough. Yeah, you can do it. Over here, um, um, bomb it first. But that's gonna be our new technique. We bomb first, and then we invade once everyone arrives. Working on a spaceport. Oh, you have a spaceport over there. That belonged to me at one time. Defense missiles have been completed. Nice. What are we working on here? What kind of tech we got? We're working on projectile batteries. That seems like a thing to have. 18 other fleets. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to look at that number. Twitch just isn't fast enough. I need, need we need more. Was that skirm skirmish of your game has been taken over? What? Serene Tailblazer taken over. Stop that. Really? We're gonna we're just gonna be a non-stop war, I think. But no, no, there will be no peace. War weariness has gone down, however. Uh, I guess because we're winning. Well, winning. We took a we took a colony. Was there a number, a, um, a meter to see what that's all about? What affects our war weariness? We're in three wars. That certainly puts a damper on things. Do we have a crash? Oh, it crashed. <clears throat> Call my fleet the 51st fleet. <laughs> the, game's, the game certainly is crashy. Every few hours is a crash. I was watching Daz Tactic play it. He was having some crashes too. Hopefully those will get ironed out. I'm sure they will. Well, not sure. I'm hopeful, hopefully they'll get ironed out before game comes out. Goes down when you invade planets and such. Okay. We'll do some more invading then. So that sounds like that means to me. My game capture. There we go. 
when was this? This was two, three, so this is five minutes ago. I guess is it save every five minutes? Six minutes, eight minutes. Um, seems like every time I get I get a crash, um, it's every five minutes I get a is when the auto save was. <clears throat> Crashes are what make the game good. It's a pretty picture. Oh my. Alright, so where are we at here? Um, nope, this one. So you are, go top up, and you're both at Nintan. I'm going to send, I'm going to change my mind. I'm going to change these guys, the first fleet, the smaller guys over here. Because there's not, there's not that much over here. So you come to Neil Gaiman, which is which is now which is falling as we speak. Go guard it. Uh, we can't get anyone in there quickly, can we? No one's no one's anywhere near here. Okay, we got our planet though down here. That's all that matters. As long as it didn't crash before that. That will take it. We'll go take that planet back. Um, and then they really want to take. There's Nintan over there. They really want to deal with. Um, hit these humans hard, but it's a bad idea. No game is is rebelling at the moment. And they're now invading. Can't get anyone. Um, here, tenth. Where's the tenth fleet at? Right there. Come here. Let's see if we can hit him before this invasion is done. Probably not. Is it falling? Yeah, it's falling. Get over there and get that. Here comes the ninth strike force. First fleet. Oh, first fleet. Where are you going? No, oh, over there. They really want to hit that. Where's big invasion at? You are out that way. Go get. Go get some troops. How's, uh, speaking, you know what? How's space looking? I think we're, we're pretty well, it's pretty well colonized. Of course, there's a bunch of spots in here that aren't colonized because there's some scary things out there. There's a little spot right over here for the humans. Other than that, everything's not necessarily colonized, but been explored, I should say. Tira are taking a lot of my stuff. Here, 1300. Okay, my fleet's arriving. It's a little laggy, yeah. Seems like we're getting obliterated. Here comes the rest of us, though. Here comes the invasion fleet. Uh, hey, you know what? Invasion fleet, why don't you take... Can we take the planet? Or should we take the station? Can we do both? There's that war. Let's just take the planet. Uh, well, wait until everyone's here. Um, set attack point. No, I'm not going to get peace with them. Let's go and fight right now. Invasion fleet. Come here. Maybe I should have sent the bigger fleet over here. 
Takes plan the station becomes yours. Okay. What is that? That's just an escort. My fleet is doing a poor job. This was the first fleet, I think? Yeah, they did a very poor job. Where's that 10th fleet at? Remember the ones I told to move here? Where'd they go? What are they doing? This is, this is, I don't understand. Look, 10th fleet. I don't understand, what, what part of attack do we know to get? Move there. It's like they, it's like they go, they complete their mission, and then, and then they're out. Big invasion. Go fill up. Okay. You can tell them to attack. We'll see what happens. There's a load of troops still. There's shooting going on over here. Did you drop your troops off before you started to go in and say hello to the to the spaceport? Uh, sure. Okay, here comes here comes the invasion. Here they come. There you go. Drop them all off. Not just half of them. I know you got more than that. Okay. There we go. There we go. Now they're all getting in there. They are doing a good job. I think we got them, though. Hostile planet type. We don't like water. We prefer the deserts. But we'll take it. Tsunami where? At where? Oh, and all oh, the, the Mondale, whatever one down there? Alright, it's my planet. It's mine. All mine. Now, uh, invasion fleet. Your job now is just to guard. Guard the place. And it's not all... There's there's some escorts and frigates around. They can, they can do some guarding. Okay. 66,000 is on the pluses here with these guys. Maybe we can get peace with them. Tyranation is... Why are we going the wrong way? Capture my ships. They capture... Oh, they capture Nanta Ray? Oh, come on now! I didn't see that. I wasn't was too busy looking at other things. Oh, man, that's a good planet, too. Oh, man. That one. I like that one. Who is this? Uh, sure, we'll end the war with that. Yeah. Okay, we're going the wrong way. We gotta get something over here. What kind of troops they got here? A lot. So, big invasion. Keep on loading up, buddy. Second fleet with no mission. I have a mission for you. I want you to come over here and attack. I'm not gonna tell them to attack because they're just gonna sit there and not attack. So I'm gonna tell them to bomb it. My people. We'll find out what happens. They've got, what, was it 3,000 there? 3,400 strength. And we have that one, and we don't have non Ray. Uh, everyone that's in... Who's that? First fleet. You're picking on them over there. Ninth strike force. What are you guys doing over there? I would rather you go and sit over here and just defend Ninth strike force. I'm going to have you set your home base here. And then I need one over, over. I need one over here. 
We got someone already stationed there, though. I don't remember who it is, but someone's there. The horde, the horde is there. What do you want? Uh, sure. Not aggression pact. I like the sound of that. Uh, they offered to end the war, and they're we. Oh, you want me? To, you want me to give you a mining station to end the war? Fine. By doing that, I can move these guys over in Neil Gaiman somewhere else. So who was coming back? That was the. Eighth? We just sent over here. Ninth? Ninth. Ninth force I was sending back to Neil Gaiman. But then to Nob. No, no, I don't want you doing that. I want you to come in over here. Let's get you over here. Get over here. Formidable skirmishes here. So we have a force of 3,400. We need more. Let's go look at um, this place. Making troops still? Yeah, they're still making them. So having some money problems. Sort of. Bombing the place we probably shouldn't bomb our own people. Mm. <laughs> uh, um. hmm. who, who are you? Second fleet. Like, I'd reckon you just do attack. You're not going to leave, though, right? As long as you don't leave. I mean, you don't need to attack that. We'll take it back. Yeah, they're pretty big. They can handle this. How big a force they have here. We got another one coming in. But, yeah, we're bigger than they are. We can handle that. Go load up. And top up your, your fleet there. Those are the wrong kind of explosions we're seeing there. I think. An invasion fleet. Uh, go back to just doing invading things. Loading troops, still. Need a lot more than that. Who's that? Ninth Strike Force has made it. Okay, good. Uh, come over here and uh, and attack. What's the strength of you? Oh, your strength is a thousand. Oh man, their stations are. I guess my stations are tough. It's a cruiser over there. Cruiser's only a four hundred strength. If we have any troops there to load up. I think my biggest issue this this game was was well going to war a whole bunch, but that was just to see things. Uh, was going to was uh, lack of troops. <clears throat> yeah, he's destroying everything. It almost seems like like we don't need much of a force as long as we can just get our troops in there. But yeah, he is blowing up anything and everything that comes nearby. Getting destroyed.
We got a foreign admiral. Okay. Did we get it? Pretty much. It's nasty. There we go. Now we got people here. Uh, Dwar, thanks for the follow. They better not rebel. I worked hard on that colony. Okay, 33. Is that all we're going to get? Probably so. Let's go over here and we'll we'll bomb it. Get them all wrapped around and then we'll invade them in one, one fail swoop. Really got beat down over here. You guys are going to put you on... Can you top up? There's no ships. There's no more ships. Put you as raiders. Second fleet is here and pretty broken. Enhance what? Enhanced um, maneuvering. We found Admiral Gooden. Yes. Um, maybe we can get peace after we take this. What did we find? A computer core. We found combined military command. Oh, right. And another tsunami. Tsunami's everywhere. Okay, so here comes the big invasion. Second fleet's out there licking their wounds. We still own this one, right? We still own Aurora, which is where the um, there's a, the fourth and the fifth are here. Fourth is repairing. Fifth's repairing as well. Uh, and then the horde is here also. Do we, need to send, do we need to send the horde over here? I'm kind of worried of sending anyone away. But just in case, I think we might we might could use their help. Just for a moment. Let's come over here and just do some blockading. Here comes the invasion. Looks cool when they all show up like that. We have the numbers, barely. I don't know. If we can break one of these, we'll be in better shape. Okay, we're now we're now bombing. Where is the horde? Here they come. No, it's ninth. The horde don't feel like playing today. They offered to end our war. Look at that. They want me to give them a mining station. I'm taking my planet, and then we can end our war. Yeah, they're worried. They're nervous. Okay, if we can get space control, we can win this fight. I don't know if it's going to happen, though. So look, we're at so 28. If it, It'll drop to like 24 or something whenever we get there. When we get space control. Horde is finally here. Um, just hit you on attack. Whatever you can do to get space control. Galaxy map, sure. Three twenty-two. Um, I kind of think it might need to go a little lower. I don't know how to get lower without bombing them. 
Abominable makes me make people real mad. Concerning news from independent traders. Reports of some what? Visiting our station say the ancient enemy is uh, consuming all in its path. Yeah, I, I don't, I just don't want to think about that. <laughs> Let's just move on from that. Clearly, I have space control. What? What? What do you I mean? What? What are they doing? How do I not have space control? Okay. Um, whatever. We're doing it. Okay. Here we go. I don't go. I don't invade unless I overpower. Which I have a lot more strength than I thought I had. Look at that. Overwhelming odds is right. All right. My planet. We get some technology out of that as well. Brute defense missiles. I like it. There's a virus out there somewhere. Okay. Okay. Horde, your job is to... This is your new home base. And I would like you to go back to... I think we want raid on you. Raid targets within range or attack targets within range. Yeah, I mean, you know, maybe attack. We'll put you on defense right now. Then we'll deal with me, with you. Big invasion, you're going to go invade and you want to go back and get some troops. Uh, well, I'll put you on invade. I think you'll do it on your own. Second fleet. Where's your home? Ma oh, yeah, that's probably a good idea. Go, go defend there. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. We should have we should have no problems getting peace with these people. Like we have I don't know why we have been doing so well, but we have against them. They're down. We've split them up. They're down here and up over this way. Let's let's have a chat. Furious with us. What do you want for peace? They will accept this deal. What am I going to get out of you? I would like a research center. I would like a mining station. I would like... Are those my spies? Okay, can I have my spies back? Um, I will give you some, techno some technology about talking with weird people. And I want your mining station, your mining station, and your mining station, and your research station. And give me back my spies! What do you think? Yeah, he says that's an excellent idea, and I say that's right. That is an excellent idea. Okay, now we got we got one war. Are we are we out of wars? I thought we had another war going. We're out of wars. Okay, we made it. Oh, a battle's raging on right now. Okay, no. Okay, we fought him off. Invaders repulsed. What if they left as we? Because we hit that treaty. Where's that at? That's down. Oh, down this way. Okay. The war is over. If you want it. Alright. We'll have a little bit. Of, we'll have a moment of peace. The war weariness will fade. And then we'll remember the good old days. Back whenever war was great. And we get to go do it again sometime. No one likes us. We uh, our uh, reputation actually is not too bad. Look at that. Uh, we're great. These guys love us. These guys are pleased with us. The 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 uh, enclave here are basically like euphoric with us. Trouble my my poor reputation and not poor reputation anymore. See zero. Uh, we have a migration treaty for... I don't know what a migration treaty is. What is it? What is a migration treaty? Where's my little pop-up here? I don't, know what that, I don't know what that is. Am I giving you a migration treaty? It's not how it works, is it? Everybody, right? We all share. We're not, I'm not just giving my maps. We're sharing our maps. 
Uh, I'm assuming it's some sort of population, you know, um, uh, immigration kind of thing. Civilians will be migrated between your colonies. Yeah, so then we should be getting, like, some of these people. I, oh, you know what? If I go over here, let's go, like, here. Is there, like, a percentage of population that is not lizard folk? No, 100% lizard folk. Any of these? Attacked by what? Oh. Pirates. Research failure. Something going on. Is there pirates over here? Is that what's going on? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, that's a good job for a horde. Now that's not doing anything. You guys are refueling. Are you refueled? Mostly. So, Widow Ninja, thanks for the thanks for the sub. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Uh, they got a mining station, and uh, yeah, let's go and send. Yeah, these guys are just a pest. Horde. I want you guys to move. You're gonna set this as your home base now, and then I want you to go and guard this place. Just a bunch of pest. Up you know, pesky pirates. The Evil Sun and the Fire Cartel apparently are all working together here. What is that? Oh. Are they fighting each other? Are you just attacking all my... You're attacking all my little, uh, my little miners and things, aren't you? My commuters? Why is there no one here? You probably should defend this place. We'll put them, they'll go guard over there, and then everything will be alright. Are you moving? Where are you? Are you moving? Yeah, here they come. Uh, I have, whoever this is, Big Invasion is down here, but they're not doing what I asked them to do. Fourth Invasion is re retrofitting. That's good. Uh, oh, the humans have a new leader. That's exciting. Uh, Highway Cavalier, thanks for the follow. Space has certainly uh, grown a bit. These gravelites are really, really basic things, but we, as so I said, like the um, the building of of mining colonies, just sort of wherever they wanted to. It's got a little out of hand. What was this all about? One of my missions, I guess, was to go here. Research stations outside. Unknown items present. Do some more scans. I think I remember seeing this place. Go away. Where is the horde? Are they there? Okay, they're there now. They should be able to take care of this then. I'm going to put them on... Oh, you're, clean, you're gonna clean it up first. That's good. This is actually compared to the other fleets that I've seen the computer doing. It's a big fleet. A bunch of cruisers in there. Do we have? We haven't made any destroyers or any battle cruisers yet, have we? We should. I don't think I have the money for it. As soon as I get it, I'm gonna make. I need to make one. Oh, we have carriers too. How much do they cost? Too much. But not my money. We gotta make a we gotta make a carrier. Because our shards can currently build this design. Oh, I can't even make it. Oh, <laughs> I can't make battleships or cruisers. I can't make anything. Wait. Oh, okay. Uh, right here. So we go out the gap. We go this way. I think we'll be all right. Yeah. I didn't say no. Because our shards can currently build this because of my money. Gotta be it, yeah. I really want a carrier and a battleship. You can see where my money's going. So let's go back over here, the horde. 
you guys should clean up. The fence means that you'll pretty much take care of all of the... Everything in that system. Formation, keep you guys in, however, you know, we can do all this kind of stuff, very loose. Well, well you know what, you can be uh, nice and tight. Attack stance, aggressive. Retain rolls as, as needed. Ships retain current roll within fleet. As needed, you can change it. Retreat when enemies are equal strength. The horde, you know, we don't give up lightly. Fleet tactics, yeah, yeah, fleet tactics. Engagement range is the same system. Invade colonies when clear. That's, that's the thing we need to be looking at. Invasion fleets. Where's where's my big invasion fleet? So we're going to go fleet tactics. Invade colonies when clear. So, well, I said it as like a fleet tactic instead of individual ship. Maybe that'll pick something. So there's still some folks around here. Do they have a colony, or is it just a station over there and a couple of escorts? Is that all they have? Is there pirates in these asteroids? Or at the sun, there's oh a couple of gravelics there. What am I doing over here? Is what I really want to see. Just see, it looks like there's, yeah, there's some things at the sun, and there's whatever's going on over here. Okay, they'll hang out there for a bit, we'll clean up whatever is picking on us, and it will be in good, good shape. Look at my war, my, uh, my, my war weariness is gone. I'm feeling good. <clears throat> feeling much better. We've grown a bit. We managed to take two colonies today. And actually, more than that, because we took uh, we took Neil Gaiman. We took that one a few times, and it kept on. It's, it did couldn't decide what it wanted to do. It's too cold there for us. We don't like those uh, frozen places, so they can have that one. Now for colonizing, I've set it up on auto, and it hasn't picked anything. Like this one. Oh, there is a ship actually going there. Storuni. In, in in enemy territory. Where's this at? Says, oh, it's not too far away. Okay, he's already on in route. Lots of, um, not us. There's yo game over there, which is in our system. You know what? Yeah, we'll take it. Now lowers none. Nalo's over there in Kappa. Um, this one beyond colonizable range. Where is it? Oh, way over there. That's a good colony. Let's way down that way. You can see where it's at with the, the little blinkies. Boo -voo. There's hey, Mars. We could go live on Mars. <laughs> Mustafar. Too much force there. Hmm. Need 50 pluses? That's not 50 plus. Are those both? Oh, yeah, because that, that's Earth, and that is, like, I don't know, one of the other ones. Oh, no, that one's up there. Okay, never mind. This is Earth, though. We could go take Earth. You know, that's a, a fitting end to this. Like, we need a, a high note to go out on, and I can't think of a better one than taking Earth. You know? It doesn't get any better than that. Big Invasion only has four. So, Fourth Invasion has a couple troops. Get some more troops on you. 
And you guys, I'm going to send you to Earth. Because that's where we're going to make our, our final stand. We're going to go Earth. We like Mars better. But uh, no one lives there, so we can't kill anyone. Uh, no, I think, I think March is it. Sorry, it's very blinky. Let's, um... As soon as it gets filled up, we're gonna move this. Oh, there's some blinking that's going on. What is there like? A big storm on Earth? Is this in a nebula? It is. In a, yeah, it's in a nebula. What's what does a gravitic storm do to me? I'm not entirely sure. Curious treasure here is disabled though. As far as I understand, yeah, there's, there's no beta. There is a beta, however, for Galactic Civilizations 4. Um, you can either go to the website or they go to the... They're on Epic. Um, I'm not sure when that one's coming out. It's coming out sometime this year. But you can get the beta for that one. Um, and if you're just into in, a space game, it certainly plays differently than this. Um, I may have to try that one out, though. Okay, we'll get as, as much of a fleet as we can here. Officer training research complete. So this is... Wh how far are we into this here? We got... We want to declare war... No, no, no. Stop that. Uh, we are at... Let's see. So we're like... Like seven hours before tonight. So we're in another couple hours. So we're about nine hours into the game. And... Check out my tech tree. Um, I'm pretty sure it goes all the way... I don't know how far it goes. I'm not entirely sure, but we're not very far <laughs> into it. Um, that's fleet carriers right there. Man, I want to build. I wish I could build a carrier and send a carrier on this on this mission. Oh, I have money now. Uh, never mind all that. Um, let's build a carrier. I want one carrier, please. And I want one battleship, please. And I want a cruiser. Spend all my money and buy those. Okay. That's what I want to see. I'm assuming they're going to be coming out of my home world. We'll send them in the soul. They'll probably get destroyed because they're going to go in through that that nebula. But that's a good it's a good high note to go out on taking Earth. Not really any fighting going on now. It's look how peaceful it is now. It's there's no red things getting yelling at me. Man, things get peaceful when there's no wars going on. Um, we'll get a pop up whenever these ships get built, so we'll go take a look at them when that happens. You're attacked by what? No, Gravelex, just a freighter. I have a lot. You can see where. Oh, I turned this off. Let me see. Migration flow, and this is okay. So we're we're like that's what, okay. I see some of our migration. Uh, our new carrier has been built. I want to see it. Is it stuck in the hangar there? It's it's stuck in the hangar. Come on, buddy. Come on out. He's shy. There he is. So you have sixteen interceptors, sixteen bombers. And, and, and that's it. And also, something you can do, which I haven't messed with. What fleet are you in? Are you in a fleet? It's the second fleet. Did you already get assigned to the second fleet? You did. Okay. Immortal Judgment is his name. Uh, so we can set up, like, individual orders, like, tactics to, like, you know, stick with the carrier and all that kind of stuff. Um, which I'm not ad advanced enough to know about. We'll wait for the next one to come out. We got a. Uh, uh, are you building the next one? You're not building it. Who's building it? Oh, you built it over here. Okay. Well, let me get you sent out where we need you to go. I need you to go. 
Let's go meet up um, in Moonlail. Look at all those gravel eggs. Just go there. Did I click on them right? I think I clicked off of them. Immortal Judgment, get over here. There's a destroyer. Where is anything else? No. Okay. That's the horde. Um. Where is this guy? So he alone is 1,200 strength. Just that one ship. I like the sound of that. I want you to leave your fleet. And I want you to join... I want you to join the, the horde. Create new fleets. Join ship immortal fleet to fleet horde. Okay. So the Horde will have a carrier. And then if we can get a battleship out, we'll get a battleship out too. Uh, what I wanted to look at was... Which one? Not resources. Tourism. Is there any, do we have any tourism going on over here? This is like a whole other aspect of the game that we didn't even deal with. And it's something that you could like, you know, if you wanted, didn't want to deal with wars, just play around with tourism all day, I guess. And economy stuff. Which I think is neat. neat. Build free fuel tankers. I'll do it. Uh, non aggression pact. And give them 10,000 credits. I will not do that. There's our exploration noise. Diplomacy. This could be kind of handy. So he's, there's our friendly guys over there. The uh, our not so friendly guys. There's more friendly guys over that way. That could have been handy. Do we ever build that ship? I want to see. I think I saw it over there. Battleship? Maybe battleships? No. Oh, we got robotic troops. That, that was a, a way down the list. Uh, we've got a bunch of cruisers, I guess, already. I never paid attention to them coming in. And two of them on, on the horde. Eviscerator here it does not have a, a, a home, so we're going to give him one. Oops. Not, not that. So you're going to join a horde. And then go be with the Horde. Okay, I got new research coming in. And... Oh, Spaceport. Hey, good, good. And, and Balerion, yeah. That's a good place. Where is... My carrier. There he is. He's almost there. <clears throat> is he, why is he just sitting there? Move faster, buddy. Maybe we should test him out on, on some little gravel X first before uh, before we sending him in, into the into the nebula. Ten exploration ships. I will not do that. I'm not giving him money. If he wants peace, he can have peace. Look how much money we have, though, right now. Like, where did all that money come from? I mean, I know where it came from. It came from... Uh, uh, 22 escorts and 10... Sure. You know what? 22 escorts, bit, whatever. Um, it came from uh, the civilian economy.
colony ship's been built. Guess they must have a home planned for him. 12 more destroyers for 106 grand? I'll do it. It's like, hey, you got money. Let's build some things. Okay. So. Horde. You have a strength of what now? 5,000. Not too bad. We still can't take out a planet destroyer. Those are 39,000 or something. Okay. No mission at the moment. Let's get one. Let's go... Um, so we can pop in over... Let's... What is that? We can pop over here real quick and, and deal with these guys. How tough are they? Yeah, it's going to be... It's going to be nothing. Let's just go here. We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. I just want to see that carrier in action. Let's get over here. Ooh, choppy toppy. Where'd they all go? Immortal Judgment is his name. Stop giving me pop-ups. I don't want to see him. Is he doing anything or is he just... Oh, here he goes. He's moving. I guess he doesn't want to show me, so we, it's going to bounce me around. <laughs> this the game is still in beta, by the way. <laughs> I think maybe he warped over or something. I don't know where he is now. Why is it so little yellow and so much blue? Because our yellow is is um, stronger than, than the blue. Fine, I guess I'll just zoom out then if you want. Um, Alright, enough of that. Um, let's get our fleet. Horde. Uh, you need to bring your fourth invasion fleet as well with you. And we're going to go into... We're taking Earth. This is where it all ends. Okay, it's going to get kind of noisy and kind of blinky over here. I'm not sure we can take Earth because there's a lot. Of, there's like 13 billion people here. But we'll see what we can do. Uh, so, move there. Uh, did you get it figured out? You. There. More frigates? Sure. Okay, and then we're going to send in a horde. It's going to go here also. Okay, strange blinks going on. Whatever. We're taking Earth, though. Yeah, it's probably a good idea. Always hold off. I would never recommend, like, a pre-order. Um, you know, you never know. We got a new colony, do we? And, oh, Yogi and Four. Okay, yeah, we got that one. That's cool. Not a good colony, but it's a colony. I wonder where those planet destroyers are at. Okay, so here comes the horde, and the invasion fleet is over this way. And then we sit, and we wait, and we take uh, our home. Our new home. Yeah, when you get on those... I don't know how to turn those off. I tried it before. The... The... Nebula sounds. I didn't see it in here. I can make less lens flare, I guess. That's just for the stars, though. I want the ships. Civilian ships. I'll turn that one off. Yeah, there's no way of changing that. I have sound way down, but... Yeah, it's a little bit, um... It's very blinky. Nothing I can do about it. <laughs> that, that seizure defense. Very crafty of them. Oh, look, you know what? That thing's tearing us up. Look at this thing. Look what it's doing to us. 
Look how damaged my ships are. Not too bad. More, more ships? Uh, okay, whatever. Okay, here we go. Blinky, blinky. Sorry, sorry. I, I, I can't help it. But we got to, we got to see it. This is the carrier. We got to see the carrier in action. Are they here yet? Oh, it's so blinky. It's driving me nuts. Are they moving? They're moving. They're just going slow. Our agent has been captured. 17 ships in this fleet. 16 ships in this fleet. Did we, did we, did we just go down? Uh, this, this one. There it is. Uh, look at the strength. Look how low our strength is. Now. What's going on? Is it just because of this? It's because of this nebula, isn't it? Tearing us apart. We found some humans. Hello, humans. Here, we are here to kill you. We're going to attack. What's going on with this place? I can't click anything. It's laggy. So much lag and blink. I can't do it. There's no one there. Good. Just a couple what? A couple little shuttles? Oh, they got little aliens outside. I want to see the carrier. Just take me to the carrier. Come on, don't crash on me, game. You can do it. I just want to see it. I just want to see the fight. Come on, game. Oh, he just chewed me up. Is that a carrier right there? There he is. There's our, there's our carrier. He's about to get chewed on. It is very laggy. Someone's, someone's blasting him. Is the interceptor going out there? Pew, pew. Can I watch from his eyes? No. Man, our fleet. Where is it at? Um... Oh, I guess we're getting some of our strength back. Okay, we're fine. Boom. Blinked out of existence. Okay, now we now we attack this. Attack. Attack the filthy humans. They're so happy living here. Another one there. Uh, deal with that. Carriers, you can see how... Let's look on him. So he's got four interceptors and one bomber left. I guess I think got blown up. I'm not sure. I'm assuming he refills them whenever he repairs. Fuel's real low. Okay, where is the, the big invasion? Nope, you guys. Attack, where are you? Why aren't you here yet? Here they come. <laughs> Alright. I will hydrate, and then we'll conquer a... Oh. As soon as these guys decide to make their way there. They're going real slow there. I think maybe they got stuck. Come on. Move it along. Days are, are screaming by and they're just stuck there. Why aren't they moving? They're not moving at all. Bomb them first. More of these aliens out here. Very, it's very laggy at the moment. Yeah, very laggy. If 
I if I realized it was gonna be this like this, I wouldn't have taken Earth. <laughs> We're here now. Now we have to. Let's blockade. I'm gonna wait for my my fleet to show up eventually. They'll get here. One <laughs> of these days. I'm just gonna zoom out. Just just wait. Epilepsy simulator. The Vardakar are like, uh, they're like aliens. Colossal Earthquake. In the old game, and, and that poor, that poor planet, which one? In the system, which planet? I feel sorry for those guys. That's a place you don't want to live. They, um, did I tell them? Yeah. Okay, they're, they're, they're getting there. They're, they're getting, they're thinking about it. I think real hard about it, but you can see that it's... I'm having a tough time with it. It's been like three years in this in this uh, nebula here. You guys have fuel still, right? How are you doing? No energy. I'm assuming it has something to do with this nebula. I know they're real nasty. Real bad. And they kind of play out where... I didn't show this till, since the beginning of the game, but you've got these nebulas in here. They're kind of like, one. Uh, they're kind of like mountains. So they sort of they sort of divide up the galaxies uh, and give you you know choke points and things. First line of defense is epilepsy. Second line of defense is lag. Yes, yes. Research insight. Good job. It's okay, this will give us, this will, this is passing some time, will give us a chance to take a look at the galaxy and let me wrap this up. <clears throat> I wonder what those, uh, those planet destroyers are doing. We like to be lost another car, another ship out there. Disabled, disabled, yeah, they got hit by the storm. Uh, why is the invasion at 700 now? Did everyone just die? No, there's no one here to defend, so we only need like five people. So just get just get a ship in here, drop it off, and we'll take it. So is it you that I'm sending it? Oh, I'm sending the wrong fleet. Whoops. <laughs> I thought I sent big invasion, but I didn't. Uh, big invasion. Sorry. Uh, you go do whatever you want to do. I apologize. Ignore those orders. Um. Yeah, <laughs> do whatever you want. Go, go refuel. Why don't you? Sorry, I didn't mean to call you here. I was very confused. Um, we're looking for these guys, and they're right there. Okay. Yeah, go get them. Plenty of you here. Here they come. Very slowly. Very slowly. What is that? They have an experimental inertialist thruster and a constitution crystal. What does that mean? Artifacts. Oh, yeah. I'll take some of those. Just the northern lights. <laughs> Look, buddy. Look, your job is to attack that. What are you doing? Why? What, what part of attack do you not get? Wait, fourth? Yeah. I don't, sometimes they just like, it's like, you know what? Nah. I'm not really in the mood for listening. I'm sure the lag has something to do with it too. Don't refuel there. No, attack it. See, now they, and they just stop. No mission. Attack. Disabled. Is he like, what's going on here? Um, horde. You do have a mission. Your mission is to 
bomb it. Maybe let's go declare war on these guys. Who is this? This is uh, Itaknin. They're displeased with us. Yeah, you should be. I just want to declare war. Alright, whatever. Okay. Now, can we please... Just take the place? Attack. Yes, yes. That's what you're supposed to be doing. Good, good. Good, good. Are you moving? Why can't you attack? They have beaten me with lag. Attack. Q and attack. <laughs> Look, when I tell him to move somewhere, he goes. Sometimes. It's a destroyer. It's a frigate. Where's the troop transport? My troops, maybe, maybe we all know my troop transports made it in here. Are they still stuck out here? I just want to take. I just want to take Earth. Please. They might be ready. For oh, you know what? I set up orders, tactics. No, I just set up. You ship tactics. Set up. Okay, never mind. Look, you get here, and and you take it. So much lag. It's hard to click anything. Okay, we're bombing it. We're doing all kinds. Let's just zoom out. Let's see if they even move. I think we got stuck in, in the nebula. Oh, there he goes. He's jumping. Okay. Stop for a moment for some reason. Now he's jumping in. Did it just say move to conquer Ananta Ray? Okay. Bombard. That's not what you're supposed to be doing. Whatever. Just get there. Move to conqueror. Oh. To a ship. Dramatic effect. Right. That's the, that. Yeah. I'm going to have to go to bed here in a minute. I was going to go to bed 30 minutes ago. I just want to, <laughs> just want to take the planet. Okay. We're bombarding the... Imp yeah. We're bombarding them. Yes. I like the sound of it. It says no mission. They are lying. I guess I told them to move last, I think. You come in here, and you attack. Got it? No troops here. Okay. Let's get it. Coming. They're just, they're just sitting out there. That's Horde, though. There's a troop transport. Who is broken? I, <laughs> I don't think it's gonna happen. No mission. No. <laughs> I just want to take the planet. That's all I want to do. They got fuel. I just want to take Earth. Please. I just want to take Earth. Refuel. Don't refuel there. Okay. 
Uh, because the game is not finished. A monologue, it's gotta be what it is. Set attack point. I just want it. I just want to attack it really. They're still bombing them. If you want to attack them, you go right ahead. You don't have your troops though. <laughs> what a sad way to end it. Yeah, they're not, they're not moving. They are broken. Well, you know what? Uh, this, uh, this amplifies the, uh, the point of, um... I want to wait till the game's out to, uh, continue this any further. So, um, I guess that's what we're gonna do. I just wanted to take Earth. I don't see why that's such a big deal. Uh, even though it's in the middle of, an, of a nebula, which I understand... Those are not things you should be flying into. But, um, you know what? <clears throat> Maybe we end it here. Look at those yellow guys. Ah, you know what? I'm rather proud of how things went. Sort of. A lot of war. I got to see all that. Uh, we managed to cut the humans in half. We managed to, to uh, uh, push back the fish folks. We, I didn't die. Um, at any point. I, I, I survived longer than I thought I would. Not, oh, he's attacking some monster out there for some reason. And, um, yeah, I, even though it's laggy and crashy, uh, it is a beta. So with, with less lag and less crashes, I would love it. So let's, let's wrap this thing up. Let's call this, uh, an end to Distant Worlds 2. And I'll probably come back to it, if not when it first, if not when it, when it releases a little bit afterwards, once... Some more of the bugs are ironed out if they are not if they're still there. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna call it. Um, I'm still a little disappointed in this. Do I still have my where's my horde horde? I still have a carrier. It's just everything's broken. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, you know I took I took Earth and Spirit. Okay, that's all we're really going for here. Just, just pretend, and and it's and it's done. All right, uh, let's let's end this thing, um, and uh, and and call it a day. Kiwi, thanks for the follow. So uh, we're gonna call it, and I'm gonna go to bed, um, and I'll probably be. Uh, I might be back tomorrow. I'm not sure. Um, I'll be back sometime this week. I'm sure, and we'll play something else. Probably some Bro Drox Operative, too, actually, if I come back tomorrow. Because I, uh, I've been itching to play them for a while, and I kind of forgot about it. 